My parents were both amazing cooks. My mom, Irish Canadian, and my dad, Portuguese. My dad would prepare old um, heritage family recipes um, that were passed down through generations, and my mom was very adventurous with cooking. I often remember her and I watching early cooking television shows and being inspired and then getting up right off the couch after we watched them, going straight into the kitchen and trying to recreate these meals. And that's how um, I developed a, a passion for all things food. In addition to my love of food, I also love to dance. I started dancing uh, probably around the age of four or five, and I actually thought I was going to be a, a professional ballerina. But I often say it was my love for all things food that kind of like led me in, in a different, on a different path in a different direction. I remember being so excited, like putting on my chef's jacket for the first time and my checkered black pants and my tall chef's hat. I was so excited, wrapping my apron around my waist. Kind of worked really hard in school and worked my way up to, to kind of want to be one of the top of the class. I think she did really well at SAID based on her whole childhood and her upbringing, like right from up both sides of the families, loving food, enjoying it cooking it, making it. I really truly believe that SAIT gave me the, the, the basics and the foundation that I needed to gradually work my way up in the industry. She has that discipline, right? And she has that focus. So like everyone knows when Connie is in the kitchen, she's very focused. As a chef and a culinarian, she's a force to be reckoned with. When I lived in San Francisco, I applied to be on Top Chef. I applied for the Vegas season, and they told me that I didn't have a TV personality and that I, and I didn't get cast for it. <laughs> and I was heartbroken, I was crushed. And I heard that Top Chef was coming to Canada. When Connie got on Top Chef, everybody in the family was beyond proud. Oh, it was a little weird, like, you see your child, like, on, on TV. She went a long way and she beat all those guys. <laughs> <laughs> the most exciting part was sharing it with all these people so they could actually see it too. And she still has that incredible ability to push forward, to be uh, creative, to continue to do new things, and to think outside the box when it comes to business as well. I'm so proud to be among so many other distinguished Calgarians that have gone to SAID and it's a great honour.